Hello, how's it going? Is someone here I can speak to, the state's attorney? They've seized my cell phone and won't give it back to me. I was involved in an assault a couple nights ago, and they arrested me instead on bogus charges from somebody else's hearsay. And the, the phone contains evidence of a, an assault with a vehicle. It doesn't matter. I mean, well, they seized it as evidence. So I'm I was sure. never given a receipt of property. They never gave me a receipt that they that they seized it. So technically, it's being held without warrant, and without proof of seizure. Can I help you? Are you here for me? No, I'm not. Don't make me famous, huh? No, I'm covering my ass. Got nothing to do with you. Appearing on my videos, nope, not a proof of guilt. It's, it's a one-party protection. Yes. The bad news is the video they need to see is in the trash can on the telephone. And okay. Well, they're after, not gonna, they won't discover anything that's on the telephone. Well, Google will. If I don't move the video from the trash can back into the photos folder, it'll automatically be deleted from my phone. Well, I mean, you can go talk to Josh Dudley. He's the one that seized it. Yeah, I saw him last night. He responded to an ATV trouble call in my neighborhood, and he refused to stop and talk to me. He sped off. I have the video on my telephone. Well, I mean, you can certainly go talk to the chief of he, police. Well, I, I filed charges for him for the, the theft of my cell phone this afternoon. So, so that's, that is where we're at. I mean, it was seized as evidence, though, until, okay. until they can... Well, Discard the case. The, the reason why I was arrested was because I was caught at a stop sign by Henry Carpenter who saw me and decided he would play chicken with me while I was walking my dog with his pickup truck. So I decided to, the, to video the, the incident. And um, Henry assaulted me with spray with an aerosol can. He beat me over the head. I've got scratches on my nose. All of this was swept under the rug in favor of putting the circus before, putting the sideshow before the circus. And those original charges fell by the wayside. As soon as Dudley showed up, he used police bias to arrest me based solely upon the word of mouth testimony he got from Henry Carpenter, who was technically the abuser in my situation. Technically, at the very beginning, I was the innocent party. And this marks the third time now well, I've been wrongfully you, you arrested. Will, you can certainly, when you come to court, you'll be appointed an well, attorney or you can hire The bad attorney. news is when I'm arrested without evidence, this goes on my permanent record now. And regardless of whether I prove my innocence or not, this is always going to be on my record. Well, had the officers had the, the peace of mind to have done their job properly the first time and actually yeah. gathered all the evidence in the case before making an arrest, this won't haunt me for, for, from now on. And that's what I'm dealing with now. I have three wrongful arrests on my record, and I'm forced to plead guilty in a court because Mr. McGrath and um, whatever the other name, the lady's name is, refused to represent me, or they misrepresent me in court. The last time I was in court here, my case was continued over a dozen times, and it took a year to get to court on a misdemeanor. And I had to plead guilty on that misdemeanor because we were sitting in pretrial and Mr. McGrath still wasn't ready and refused to speak to me at all. Um, I really don't know what to do other than make a huge scene because if you're going to send me to prison, I might as well make a stink about it. You can talk to Christmas and the chief of police about... Like I said, since he seized my cell phone without warrant, I'm charging him with the theft. They don't need a warrant to seize it if it's part of an investigation. So, and they did have it in the report that they did Well, the investigation it. I wanted them to do, they're not doing because they have a personal beef with but me. But that's something you need to take up with the chief. That's not, we can't well, control the... I would like to see the agency. chief of police resign because of, of again, this going on. we don't control that either. That's, well, I'm, 
We I don't know. control the city of Marshall. I know. So. I would like whoever it is to get me a warrant so we can get on that phone and you can review the evidence. I want to see Henry Carpenter arrested for, I know this is not a real charge. It's going to be called attempted vehicular manslaughter because he saw me, he screamed at me that he was going to kill me, he got in his truck, and he drove a block on the wrong side of the street to chase me off the road using his pickup truck. Well, Chris, I mean, if you think there's been a crime committed, you need to report that to the local law enforcement agency, whether it be the Sheriff's Department or Marshall PD. Well. We don't have an investigator in this office that can investigate crime. You know what? We base it on their investigation. The, the charges against me this time, I can use the precedent from the last case I was forced to plead guilty to as an excuse to exonerate me from the, the case you're about to charge me with now. So think about that for a moment when I leave your office.